Hey guys, welcome to the Testing Academy and let's discuss about the how you can balance your life between high salary versus job satisfaction. All right. So let's go through it. So what I have noticed. Uh, so generally, if you go right, you are starting a job, job, you don't have much choice, right? Whenever you are starting as a fresher, you don't have a choice, many choice. I mean, you have to live with it. So many times people are getting into MNCs or they will go to the startup right these are two choices generally they do have right what what uh, what i have seen is after one to three years there is a opportunity where you can switch to a right company okay so initially as a fresher you don't have much choice uh, if you are getting a high salary that it's good if it's if you are getting a job satisfaction or a great company that is good but even if you uh, you don't know actually when you are starting your career you will not able to get the clarity if the company or the job satis satisfaction is important for you right now or not this is my personal point so after one two years right one to three years of experience you will get a clarity okay now either uh, uh, i need to search for the higher salary plus job satisfaction a balanced company now right so most of the company if you see lacks in some way some give you the good work but uh, terrible work work culture or a salary uh, so it is very difficult to find the difficult for find the balanced company that i have told you many times right and you will know the company was bad or good when you leave it many times uh, i mean bad for bad you can you can you will know when you are in the also so i'm talk, i'm going to talk about my experience okay so when i was uh, at one to three years experience i i basically joined a company which is giving me a very decent salary but the work culture was terrible right and we used to work for 14 15 hours uh, for almost not 14 almost 11 to 12 hours a day yes so we used to join at eight mo uh, nine in the morning and working till 10 p.m in the morning right so work culture was as well as joe's satisfaction was a uh, little terrible at the time and uh, salary was good so again you have to make your choices you have to find the balance company right and trust me you will eventually be finding i mean the you will not know if the company is good. This is really important. I give you pay attention to this, what I'm saying. You will know the company is bad because uh, probably due to your manager, probably you, due to manager, you will know that your company will is bad, but you will not know if company is good. You will know only when you leave the company and join a, another bad company. This is really important. Pay attention to this, what I am saying. Okay. So this is it. Even if you find a greater salary plus great work, you may find that you, that manager who is micromanaging and basically, basically giving you a hard time, right? So finding a balanced company is really, really difficult. And for fresher, definitely I have seen less number of choice. If you have, if you're experienced, it will take time, but you will find a balanced job eventually. Okay. So job certification, I think it's a myth. I'll tell you why, because it is very hard to get, uh, nowadays after one, two years of experience, uh, you will be in the same page where what exactly it means is this is the company that you are right now working, right? And you think job satisfaction is very good. The work that you are doing is very good and they are paying you a good salary. But after one or two years, you will be basically put down to a particular project which you don't like. So your job satisfaction will go down, but your salary is okay, right? Because you have worked for like two, three years. So this is actually, you will see it's a cycle. It's a basically a cycle, right? You are keep on finding the good company. When you find the good company, you will keep on finding the good company. Actually, it's a cycle. This is what I have seen, right? So my, I'm going to talk about my 10 years experience. Okay. First year, if you say, if you say low salary, bad work, I mean, started with the low salary, bad work, great work. Okay. Salary, but bad culture, right? Balanced job, two, three years, low salary, but after two, three years, bad work. Okay. High salary, but bad work, which not to say. Okay. So now after seven plus years, I would say, which not to say, but you get the point, right? So low salary and bad work i mean if you are at low salary and bad work you are doing something wrong with your life with your life okay so make sure you switch here and introspect and change please guys if you have this uh, if you are basically fall into this quadrant right make sure you change make sure you change your job immediately and i've prepared a very simple uh, table for you high salary good work very rare to find high salary bad work i think this is common 
लो सैलरी गुड वर्क स्टार्टअप मोस्टली लो सैलरी बैड वर्क कॉमन बेसिकली मीन्स एम एन सीज ओके हाई सैलरी बैड वर्क डजेंट मीन एम एन सीज दे मेस्टली मोस्टली स्टार्टअप ओके ऑल राइट टेबल ऑफ सैलरी वर्सेज वर्क आई थिंक चेक दिस टेबल एंड रेयर इज रेयर इज वेर यू हैव टू कीप ऑन फाइंडिंग टिल दी एंड दिस इज वट आई एम टोल टू राइट हाई सैलरी एंड गुड वर्क you just you will be keep on finding this thing you will go from this to this most of the time and uh, i think we are on a, uh, this is uh, really important i think we are on a mission to find the perfect job till we retire if you are agreeing type yes in the comment okay if this is my personal view where we are on a mission to find the perfect job till we retire actually all right so uh, now tips for the balance work okay uh, this is important balance job is a job where you get high salary or a decent salary as compared to the market and you are doing a good work with your balance life what exactly is a balance life is where uh, you are working as a 9 to 5 and in 6 to 7 you are basically going to a gym and properly nobody is basically you are giving the time with your family right you are eating a proper food and nobody is basically pinging you or calling you there is a thing please review my pr or please do this and these things right those things are balanced life okay and uh, you are taking proper uh, proper breaks or holidays and uh, you are not missing the holidays i mean to say i have seen people in 6 month they have not taken any single leave which doesn't make sense please make sure you utilize your leaves properly give a break to your brain right this is really important so this is actually that balance life i'm talking about uh, another thing is you can side hustle to do the buy balance life side hustle basically mean you can do the things that i am doing like create a video uh, work as a qa consultant and those thing basically improve or improve or give you a another satisfaction okay even if you have high salary bad work this thing uh, side hustle can improve your uh, work right you can learn here you can keep on doing the bad work but you can do the good work in the side hustle also that thing is there keep learning make your own mistakes right high salary job satisfaction will come eventually this is really important so somewhat uh, somewhat agree with you think right people will say don't go with i uh, this is really important point people will say that don't go with high salary and low job low job satisfaction but i think they are wrong i'll tell you why there are couple of people even in the survey right most of the people are saying that go with don't go with the high salary plus low job satisfaction but what i have seen is uh, you can improve your job job satisfaction with the extra thing that you can do uh, which basically means that i have told you right you can do side hustles you can do qa consultant work extra work which will basically give you satisfaction so you can do that i have done it many times and you have to climb you have to climb the ladder fast right for example uh, let me draw something for you guys okay so this is your salary zero and suppose you are going to 50 lakhs till you retire right so this is actually a ladder how early you go to the 50 lakh right this is really important if you are going like this uh, this is your age like 10 for example 10 year experience 15 years experience 20 years experience how early you are going how early you are going to the 50 lakhs right this is important okay so i hope this makes sense uh, this was a video about the how say high salary versus job satisfaction so now the conclusion uh, i will give you make sure you prepare a list of company where you think you will get a high salary and the job satisfaction okay there are a couple of good companies right now in the indian market as well as in the us market where they have good balance life good good job satisfaction and high salary so make sure you target them properly okay uh, as a fresher generally you don't have a much choice so generally after one year or two years experience you can basically go with the job satisfaction if you are learning something new in the company it will give you more job satisfaction rather than the existing thing existing frameworks and all for example if you have worked on rest assured right now and if you are going to join a company where your rest assured is already implemented or they have created their own framework your job satisfaction parameter will be little low in this case or if there is a there are there is a company where you do you have to create something from scratch automation framework from scratch your job satisfaction will be really really high okay so pay attention to these points also all right thanks a lot for watching this video till now i hope you make i hope uh, you have learned something new from this video with this concept 
if you are uh, someone who want to know more about it or you want to discuss something comment down below make sure you give it a like right now and i'll see you in the next video bye